<laughs> hey guys, what's going on? Dan here. Welcome to another episode of Feature Friday. I'm with my bestest friend in the whole world, John. Not bestest, but I'm his friend. Close enough. We're standing in front of the Cougar 29 RDB. Now this does say half ton on the front, John. So Correct. what I want to do in this video, obviously I work here too, but I want to kind of pretend that I'm your customer. Mm -hmm. As you're walking through, show me some of the highlights and then I figured I'd ask some questions of you. Mm -hmm. My first question is half ton. So does that mean any half ton can pull this? No, this, this particular coach weighs 8,100 pounds. Uh, a lot of the new half tons, no issue, because they're all rated around 10 up to 12,000 pounds, which I never thought I'd say in this day and age. But your older half tons would probably struggle with this. But Cougar saw the need with the newer half tons, fifth wheels, so you don't have to go to a big three-quarter ton or one ton, so they introduced the Cougar half ton series. And Cougars are awesome campers, isn't it? Number one sold camper for 18 years. No other manufacturer has done that. 18 years? 18 years in a row. I had no idea. Yes. Well, let's go ahead and take a look. Sure. We're inside the showroom, so we're not going to do a lot of the bells and whistles on the outside. I mainly want to focus on the inside, but if you guys want to see something on the outside or you have a question for John, leave a comment down below and we'll be sure to answer it for you. Absolutely. Absolutely. Dan, what we are, we're in the 29 RB, RDB Cougar Half Ton. This is a great floor plan, especially for people with grandkids, a lot of people to sleep, because starting in the back, you actually have two double beds down. Again, we talked number one in the industry. Cougar makes the biggest double bunks in the industry. Nobody makes them this big. So actually, if it's not kids, you could actually sleep two adults in either one of these beds. So if the friends want to come along, you could actually have four adults in the back as well. Let me let me take a look. Absolutely. Oh, well, it is a lot of space. See, that's actually what I was thinking of. Like, our son's grown up. Sure. So we could push him off here, close the door, lock it, and pretend he's not there for the weekend. <laughs> you could do that. Or, you know, when you have your friends and family come over, you could put them in there. You have space for them. Sure. Of course, that's also an excuse for them to stay with you on camping. So, mm -hmm. But no, that's a great space. That's part of it. Something else I noticed, John, is my one of my favorite things is the couch is directly across from the TV. Absolutely, no more craning your neck sideways, which we don't do at home. And then this is big, who wants it, who can't ask for this? Big 50 inch flat screen, which you can't adjust. So if somebody's in the kitchen sitting at the booth, everybody has access to the TV and you're not turning your head constantly and you end up wanting to watch a TV show and then you have a sore neck. No, directly across from the TV, just like home. It's fantastic. And then that sofa also, I know we talked about sleeping. That turns into a full bed that two adults could sleep on as well. So now I got four friends crashing the yeah. party. Well, no, not done. The booth will turn into a bed as well, so you can add a few more to your list. Okay, so let's talk about the booth. Sure. Does this model come with the option of a freestanding dinette? Absolutely. We have a lot of customers order it with the freestanding that don't need the extra sleeping space. Probably the biggest advantage to the booth, not as well as sleeping, but you also pick up storage underneath as well. So you have storage, storage up underneath? Storage under both booth seats. See, I like, no, this is just personal preference, I like the freestanding dinette. We have friends come in, play cards, whatever. You feel like you have more space. But I can see this working for a couple or even when you got the little rug rats in here. Absolutely. Very nice, nice size kitchen space in this unit. Huge year. kitchen and eight cubic foot refrigerator. Biggest refrigerator you're going to get in the market unless you go to a double door. And obviously in the half tons, double door is not, that is not an option. Well, you know, I always tell everybody when I'm doing these, I, I'm an avid camper. I don't have a Cougar, I have a Puma. Sure. Bought it from here. Sure. Uh, this is the size refrigerator we have. We go on vacation for usually a week, week and a half at a time. We do have to make a couple of runs to the grocery store during the week. Sure. But it's not like you have to have three coolers with you to keep all your food. Like, this does a really good job. Plenty of room. Plenty, Plenty of room. room. You also have a 22-inch oven. Everybody else uses a 16. So, frozen pizzas, whatever else you want to do. Cougars also added the tempered top, so this also actually becomes a backsplash, backsplash, excuse me, and then the three burner range as well. And then as we walk over here, storage is king, as we know. You have a place for wastebasket, whatever else you might want to throw in there, and then your cabinet space up above, uh, cereal, you name it. And then these are all hardwood cabinets. Everything's countersunk. There are no staples in this coach. Oh, that's So nice. you're looking at a well-built unit. But then that's why Cougar's been number one for 18 years. Nice, deep, squared off, stainless steel sink, 
and it's inset. When you're washing dishes, water doesn't have a chance to run over the counter. Everything's inset. And then these are one inch drains, just like you have in your sink at home. And you know what's really nice about a big sink like this that I never thought about, and I know my wife never thought about it either when we were shopping for our camper, is when you do stay in these in a week and you've got a couple of additional people with you, you you're going to accumulate a lot of dishes. And oh, sure. to be able to offset those instead of having them sit sure. all over your counter, like this is nice, detachable sprayer, which is nice. You can spray people when they get on you your nerves. You can do that. My boys would do that. Yes. Very familiar. <laughs> I'm sure the boys are going to have some comments on Facebook Oh, for they you. absolutely will. And then with your sink covers, it all also opens up your counter space as well. Even though there's quite a bit here, we have it decorated now, but a lot of counter space. And let's get, you know, it's a big kitchen. Mm -hmm. For a 29-foot fifth wheel, yeah, with a lot of sleeping too, which I know we haven't. We gotta check out bedroom. Yeah, I wanna show you bathroom. real quick. Oh. Underneath, you still have full pull-out drawers, all metal ball bearing roller glides. So really, in the kitchen, there's nothing you're gonna have to leave. So two of the three open. The third one's decorative. No. Oh, there you go. I just had to use... Gotta be a little stronger than the drawer. I gotta use muscles. Yes. A uh, neat feature that many people don't think about. Cougar does an inset uh, jacket. So if you want to hang your jackets here, you've actually got some place to uh, put them. We'd like it to be warm all the time, but a cool evening you come in, you actually have a place to hang your jacket rather than laying it over the booth or the sofa. Car keys. That's a great thought too. Dog leashes. Yeah. Yeah, Fantastic. You name nice it. little spot. And a little cork board of all the honeydew list things that I have to do when yeah, I get home. We won't do that. But <laughs> yes. Cougar does a great job. If you've ever been in some of the other manufacturers, your hot water heater button, everything's put all over the coach. They do a complete control panel, all your switches, everything's labeled and everything's right here. So you're not searching all over the coach for slide buttons, awning buttons, hot water heater buttons. It's all located in one central place. TV remote? No, that's actually the best thing since sliced bread. That's actually the Cougar remote. You can actually keep that in your pocket. You're walking away from the coach. You forgot to put the awning up. Turn around, hit your button, and you can put your awning up from 70 feet away. Will this do slides also? It will. So you're telling me that I can step out, run a slide out, and see if I'm going to hit a tree? No more no more. somebody else going out, pounding on the wall if you're too close. Take your little remote out, do your slides by yourself. Don't have to worry about any damage. Oh, and in all fairness, I was totally setting him up. I knew that wasn't a TV remote. <laughs> uh, another great thing, it's a small thing, but it's a great thing, cantilever door. So no longer when you open a door do you have to step down on the steps, especially at nighttime. So it's it's a much safer way and it's it's a better way to do it. Yeah, because I have room to pass through. Absolutely, right now and Cougar's always open. looking for that. Okay, I'm gonna step into the bathroom. Please. I'm actually gonna stand in the shower. Now I'm gonna tell you this. This is probably my must-have feature in a coach. Sure. Again, one of those things I never would have thought of when I was shopping initially, but now would be a must is the seat in the shower. Yeah. It yeah. feels more comfortable, and I'm lazy. More residential. More residential. That's Absolutely. good. Absolutely. Now, this is a big bathroom, John. It's huge. Uh, small thing, but people don't talk about, this is actually a porcelain toilet. Same style of toilet as you have at home. And when you go to porcelain, it's normally going to sit higher than the old plastic toilets do, and it won't hold stains, and it's much easier to keep clean. That's awesome. And plenty of storage. Plenty of storage. And then even behind you there, Dan, you actually have a place for your towels, linens, whatever else you want to do. Oh, yeah. This is a really big unit. You said it's 29 foot. 29 foot, 8,100 pounds. And then as we come into the bedroom, uh, you actually have a slide-out closet. And if you'll notice, there's not much you're going to have to leave behind. Uh, hanging clothes, shirts, whatever else you want. And you still pick up two small shirt closets on each side of the bed as well. They also give you 110 outlets on each side of the bed. I seem to be running into it more these days, a lot more sleep apnea that you hear about. Yep. And that gives you the ability to use your machine right next to the bed, just like you do at home. I'm also noticing they have USB plugs back uh, here as well. Yes, they do. That's fantastic. And I like, I felt weird at first with this step up, but I like you have no. plenty of room on both sides yeah. of the bed. Yeah. So it makes it easy to make the bed. It makes it easy to get in and out of bed. Right. And then you'll notice you actually have about a two-foot dressing aisle in front of the bed. You're not stuck up against the wall. So if you want to change clothes in here, you can. It's much easier to access. Well, this is fantastic. 
you do have, which we all get asked, I know TV's king these days too, but you do have a port for a TV in the bedroom. They even give you a backer if you want to put your own wall hanger on so you know where to put it and then you can connect in and you'll have the same TV up here as you do in the living area. Well now one advantage of that, or multiple advantages of that, but one of them is when you have the four annoying house guests, you can escape up here, watch TV in private. Come up here, watch your show in your, pri in, in your own privacy, you're exactly right. And not everybody can agree on the same show anyway. Well, John, we know each other. You're awesome. He does a great job on videos. I really appreciate it. Um, I think you answered all of my questions. As I said before, if you have more questions, you want to see something on the outside or you want to see a different unit, just leave a message below. John's active on Facebook. One of us will respond to you. We'll make sure we get the video. And as always, thanks again for watching uh, Feature Friday.